Hey besties, welcome back to the Blonde Foodie. I'm Heather. How are we all doing today? I'm not eating, but I am gonna do another get ready with me. So let's begin. So, what is today? It is Tuesday. How are we all doing this Tuesday? I know the last few videos I have up, I've been complaining about this heat in Pennsylvania, but the complaining has ended. It is cold. <laughs> Pennsylvania weather, man. I swear. You wake up, it's 50 degrees, it's cold. You get to the afternoon and you take off your sweaters or hoodies. Any kind of a liar, take it off. You're in a tank top and shorts. It's 80 degrees again. My nightfall is back down to 40s. <laughs> it really is ridiculous. Gotta love it. So I already primed my face. I figured. I might do a quick little car mukbang later. So I thought maybe I would take this time to update you guys. <laughs> Sophie's sneaking around in the background. A quick little minute, give y'all an update. So Sophia's birthday is coming up. I can't even believe it. How many days, Soph? How many days? Seven. Seven days. <clears throat> till she's officially ten. And also till we leave. So excited. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. So excited. I just put in for... She knows nothing about anything, and I love it that way. I like it, but I hate it at the same time. She loves it because she knows she can trust me, and she knows that whatever is coming, it's going to be awesome. I still look so red. I did not sleep the best last night, and I didn't sleep too much because we had some friends stop over late, and... They needed some help welding some part for his Jeep. So that was fun. But anyway, I'm just about done. I think I finished with the camper stuff. There's nothing else I can really do with it until like the day before and morning of clothing, coolers, food, all that fun stuff. So till then, we are just kind of hanging out, doing school, preparing, getting any kind of schoolwork we can done before, um, if possible, honestly. If they get done most of their work, then they don't have to actually be present in any classes while we're away. So that'll be nice. No, they could just focus on having fun while we're up there. I know that looks dark, right? This lighting is really not the best. I'm gonna have to find better lighting. Change my backdrop. Honestly, <laughs> I only have gray, to be honest. And I kind of feel like that's not helping the lighting situation at all, but that's what we have and we work with what we have. I don't know what's really happening today. It's going to go one of two ways. I do have plans with a friend today, but...
I got a call this morning that wasn't the best. Not the best news, but we're hopeful and we're praying. And that is all that matters. Like, do you see that? I don't know. It's not even there, but according to this lighting, I look like a raccoon. But anyway, we're praying. We're going to stay hopeful. Positive. I'm just waiting for an update. But for now, we are here. I'm sorry. I just took a moment. <laughs> we are here. And we are doing the damn thing today. We are just doing it. 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 Whatever it is. Whatever comes my way, it was meant to be. And here we are. Making funny faces. Out of camera. Loving our flipping lives, yes? Really, what else can you do? <sighs> I've just seen a TikTok of a girl who takes their blush like all the way up like, to their hairline. And honestly, I really loved it. <sighs> it was different. I know, I put product on and then I blow it off, but clearly there's plenty. What else did she do? She went like across her face. Like, almost like if it was winter, snowy, and you're cold out, obviously, you get really red all up in here. And that's what it, that's literally what it looked like. It was really pretty, though. I loved it. I really wish this lighting was better. Is that better? Whatever. So I think that's all I'm doing, honestly, with my face. I'm going to put my mascara on and call it a day. Because <laughs> I really don't want to focus too much on it. So I really know what I'm doing, honestly. So we're going in with the favorite, Lash Paradise, again. Boop. I don't know if you guys even care about my products I use. I don't care for too many things, but this and my foundation I use are my lifeline. And yeah, I mean, look how different. My eyes already open. Gorgeous, I say. It's flipping gorgeous. Guys, I'm really sorry if I'm like kind of being a downer, but that call I got earlier is like slightly triggering me. So, my light just burned out. That's awesome. So, oh, I'll tell you later. When I'm done. See, I do actually have long lashes. But, you can't see them because they're so flipping blonde. I thought coming on and making a video would honestly distract me, but it's not doing it what I hoped it would, honestly. I mean, I'm still in my pajamas. I didn't even want to get dressed. I will. Don't worry. I will. But like for the video, I didn't really. I figured it's a get ready with me, right? So... What is the point? I 
of getting ready before it. Yes, loves layers, layers, and layers. Mascara it up. I think that's why I love this brand so much. I can literally keep layering. And it just layers so, so well. Why does it look weird there? Bold. <laughs> Whatever. So I think I'm going to go up my typical leggings and a flanny today. I think it's going to be like 60 something. High 60s. All right, now that I've taken five minutes to do my mascara. <laughs> joy, joy. Um, I don't even feel like putting setting spray on. I don't feel like it's needed. No brushed hair. <laughs> no nothing today. We're going to do a quick little wave. Just to give some kind of life to it. me knows how much I hate blood hair. I'm a teaser. The bigger the hair, the closer to God. Ow. Like those kinds of things, I swear. Tons of people would say that I'm from the South or something just because of how high I make my hair or certain hair views that I do do. I just whew, go big. Go big or go home. You only live once, just do whatever you want with your hair. Do whatever you want with your makeup. I was just watching a YouTuber too. Uh, she's super young. She's just starting out with like makeup. She decided to use YouTube as her outlet to get confidence to starting makeup. And her comments were back and forth, negative, too young, this, that, and the next. And the other ones were like so good, like, super complimenting her and breaking out and doing her thing. I mean, if your parents are approving you, then I feel like it's fine. Honestly, it's your life. Your parents, if they think you're safe doing what you're doing, then they know best. They know you. They know that your situation. Go for it. She's just an inspiration. I think she's like 17. Like she's 17. Okay. <laughs> she's not like 12 or something. But I think her story was something like no makeup, no, um, no provocative clothing, uh, just very strict life. I'm not sure if she's religious or anything, but she comes, she tells her whole story, um, in one of her first videos, but she's just inspiring on days that you just don't feel like getting up or getting ready for your day or anything like that just listen to five minutes of that girl and you will get up and do something with your hair you will get up and do something with your face you will at least wash your face or wash your hair and you're gonna just go into a out different outlook that day so i'm just doing a quick wave I don't, i'm not gonna go all the way to the bottom i just want to do a top layer and leave the bottom it's so crazy when i was younger my hair was so much longer than this and i mean i say younger but i feel like that's where i can relate to this girl i was very, very sheltered as well. I wasn't allowed to do my hair, makeup, or anything like that till I was probably around her age as well. But my hair was like all the way down past my butt. I would sit here for literally three hours to straighten it, but you know, products back then were not what they are today. 
And I just like remember sitting on my bedroom floor and just looking at myself like, wow, I'm so cool. I get to straighten my hair finally all by myself. My mom would take me to the salon to get it curled for holidays or anything like that just to make sure we didn't like damage it. But in the end, I'm not really sure what they did because they damaged it. But times have changed. Products have changed. All right, so that side's like done. I'm just gonna let them set. Um, I do not use hairspray in my hair. Mm -hmm, like ever. I guess if I'm teasing, I'll do a little, a little spritz, but I'm really not, I'm not using much. <laughs> My part is all over. Oh. It's going to be a messy hair day. Don't curl to the end. I only do like the mid part. I don't go all the way up. I don't go all the way down. I don't know what that was. So, I think I'm going to definitely try that mukbang later. It's going to be a car one. I'm probably going to have both kids. Probably. But it's just going to be a taste test. I literally watched a video this morning. And I have to go try it. It is something spicy. But we'll see. The girl I watched this morning... She already went to this place and tried to get them, but I guess they didn't actually have them. And it was a huge fail. But she ended up going back, finding them. And she, her reaction to it says, they're all spicy. You leave me a comment down below if, if you want to take a guess at what you think I'm talking about. That would be fun. I love a good guessing game. She's making funny noises. I don't know, what should I make my backdrop? For some reason, I thought seasonal earlier. I should have orange or something right now, purple, Halloween colors. Hmm, she's jumping around like a crazy lady. Um, I thought that would be fun. Sorry, I'm just like not 100% with it today, but that, you know what? I said it once, I'll say it twice, and I'll say it a million times. Good, the bad, the ugly, just the real. Like, this is me through and through. Good days, bad days, better days, greater days, worse days, down days, whatever it is. Whatever is coming my way. I swear I haven't changed anything about my hairstyle in years. Since I started curling my own hair and doing my own hair, I have done this forever. So what, 2000? 
should I show my age? <laughs> so since like 2004, 2005, I have done my hair pretty close to the same way. All right, so now I just take everything and I brush it out and it gives it a little wave. Like just enough. And girls out there will understand this, but we always have a better look inside. That's this side, always. See? Bloop. Always. Why? I don't know. But that's it. This is the look for today. I hope you all had a great time hanging out with me while I got ready. I appreciate you so much for distracting me. Make sure to like or subscribe if you want to see any of my next upcoming videos. I hope you all have a blessed and great day. And please, 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 please comment down below for anything that you want to see me do next. I will talk to you all next time. Bye.